what we didn't understand, of course, is that we're not actually competing for each other's eyeballs. We're, we're, we're now competing for the love, if you like, or the favors of the algorithms that sit in the middle of this control by a very small number of very large companies. So, so I think the aha moment for me wasn't that long ago. I wish it was earlier, but it was 2016 when Buzzfeed wrote that uh, fantastic article about those kids in Macedonia who uh, had figured out that if you just wrote, write bullshit, you, you come up with any story you want that happens to resonate with a certain echo chamber that has been created by Facebook's algorithm, then you will get far more shares and likes and retweets and, and engagement and therefore eyeballs coming back to your website than, than anybody who's trying to find a balanced view across the whole audience. And so the easiest thing to do is just to lie and create stories that resonate. So we had Donald Trump is endorsed by Pope Francis. So we had, you know, uh, Obama's birth certificate discovered in Kenya and, you know, just stuff like that. And they were making a really healthy living by just steering eyeballs from passionate Republicans during the election who were, who were you know, caring about this thing. And then ultimately, um, you know, what that amounts to is the fact that if I'm the New York Times, or for that matter, I'm the Wall Street Journal, and I have a structure that says I need to spend money um, getting it right. I need to have a hierarchy of editors who, who, who check on my work, who fact check things, who, who bring editorial uh, integrity, but also bring in lawyers and also spend money to send people to events to verify things. The cost of, uh, of verifying the truth for a journalist is, is, is high, but we always believed that it was the appropriate thing to do because that's how your brand and reputation and everything else was developed. Um, now, in fact, if I am just competing for those eyeballs, uh, via the algorithm, I lose out by spending money against, against somebody who can just make stuff up. Right. So that struck me as just absolutely broken. 